Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne 9 and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Arrow Season 7, Episode 21 called Living Proof. So, Tommy helps Oliver. And that was a huge, what the freak is, is happening. And then we cut to Ray helps Diggle out, and he's fine. Then Dina is fine, and then Renee is fine. They managed to find everyone, and everything's great. Then the police are um, taking off Lissy's stuff, and they try to arrest her. And uh, she KOs the entire police people that were there and run for it. Then we have a flash forward scene where Felicity sees a commercial for Zeta by the Galaxy One. Then we go to the parts of the day where Oliver talks to Tommy and we have an escape fail. Oh, well, he managed to escape from the two center blocks he was blocked in. And um, we see that his bow is broken. Then Oliver again talks to uh, Tommy. And it's just very, very bizarre for me. I was like, what? We have a flash forward scene where William is going to go see the CEO, but Felicity says no. And then Will gets really mad at her. And then Felicity got a target. Then we have the present day where Felicity contacts the team. And she can only get through everyone except for Oliver. And then um, I'll go Oliver again talks to Tommy, and he has an escape fail. So every time it's just, Tommy says, like, I don't think that's going to work. And he's like, well, I'm going to try it anyway. And it's not working. <laughs> and then we cut to where Roy decides he wants to turn himself in. And then we cut to where the building is going to blow up and they have eight minutes. And then uh, Tommy and uh, Oliver talk some more and they argue and another escape fail happens. So, Roy and the team come across this gas, you know, it's very poisonous, you can die like in like 12 seconds. And so, um, Oliver, I mean, Roy decides to risk it and jumps through and does all these acrobats and jumps through the gas and turns off the building so that way it won't blow. And um, so he saves everyone and he's still alive and he's going to be fine. What? Uh, then we cut to where Emiko is at the lair and fried the system and get, tells, and Felicity tells her that she's pregnant and like, don't do what happened to your mom. Happened to me. And so, yeah. So and then she left. And then we cut to where Tommy tries to reach Oliver and again, it's not happening. And the time about like, um, Emiko and the whole situation. And then a hole opened up, and so Oliver plans to leave him. And he does. Then we cut to Redina, talks to Roy, that Felicity is worried about um, her kid, and kind of vents to Alina. And then we cut to a flash forward scene where Mia talks to Will and tells him to confront Felicity, not just like bitch and moan about it, just literally just confront her about it and get it done. And then um, we found out that he made a point with the CEO at Galaxy One. Then we go to present day where Oliver found the team, and then they get surrounded by Emika. Then we have a fight scene, and that was all very cool, and I really enjoyed that. And then we have Emika versus Oliver, and Oliver off Emika. But the reverse happened where the entire team died, which is weird. And then we cut to where Oliver it was still in the room and he never left. Then Oliver literally breaks down. Then Tommy finally got through to him. And then Oliver wakes up and gets rescued by his team. And then we have uh, the green arrow at the SCPD. And then we have a flash forward scene where William is at Galaxy One and meet with CEO and Renee. And then CEO leaves and he managed to download the system off his computer and then but he got surrounded then we have alina will help felicity and everyone and uh, we found out that the team got surrounded and then we go to present day where it's basically complete crap at scpd it's like pure hell and then we have really cool fight scenes, and then Oliver talks to Emiko, and it's like, I'm not going to hurt you, I'm not going to beat you up, it's just not happening. 
and he was trying to reach her, but she just kind of escaped and left. And that was the end of the episode. Um, really good episode. I really enjoyed it. I give this one a solid, strong A. I thought it was really good. It had really good scenes in it, fight scenes, and, you know, Dinah talking to Roy and, you know, trying to understand where he's coming from and everything. And just the... And I also love the flash war scenes, so really cool too. Anyway, that's wonderful for this video. So, this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think of the episode, do you agree, disagree? There's only like a couple of things I didn't like about the episode, but it was like super minimal. But anyway, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everybody.